attack. Now, downtown Pocatello prides itself on preserving its rich history. That's why the Historic Preservation Commission is updating resources to make sure that its history is maintained. The HPC is updating their sign guideline brochure so business owners know exactly what it's, what it's uh, looking for. Uh, pictures of different accepted signs are the main addition. The old brochure didn't have pictures at all, so now all signs in the downtown historic district are required to reflect the area between 1892 and 1939. The brochure also explains the sign review process and includes design tips. Some tips are how to properly light your sign and recommended materials. Like many other businesses in the area, Black Rail Antiques owner Guy uh, Cotorenio used a local sign company. He wouldn't have done it any other way, he says. I'm not artistic enough to do it myself anyway, so I would have had to hire somebody. So it was just easier to hire somebody that knew what they were doing and everything. And they handled the whole process, and it was pretty easy. Now, business owners are still encouraged to put their individual tastes and style into their sign designs. They just have to be compatible with the guidelines for the area. The HPC will be meeting tomorrow to finalize the brochure. The meeting is at 6 p.m. at 6.